These are the top three accessories I think you should put on your battlefield radio without even thinking. We're not covering antennas in this video because that's one I think you should think about and that's a whole nother discussion, but these three accessories are budget, they're easy to get, they're easy to put on your radio, and I think that every single Baofeng you own, pretty much regardless of use case, should have these accessories, with one of them having a little bit of an exception. But number one accessory I think you should put on every single Baofeng radio you own, no matter what, is the volume knob ring. You probably can't even see it right now, but if you zoom in real close, around the volume knob on this radio, there is a little ring around the base of it. And all that ring does is make the volume knob on this radio a little bit harder to turn. If you already own a Baofeng radio, you know that that volume knob is really, really easy to bump. Especially if you put it in a pouch or something, that knob is getting bumped. And the problem with Baofeng radios is the power selector is also on that knob. So if I bump that knob, I could turn my radio all the way off and I'm just sitting there I'm thinking, why is nobody talking? It's because my radio turned off and I didn't even know. Or it'll turn it up way too high and you'll blow your ears out. It's a whole nother matter. So with that little inexpensive trick, I can totally fix the problem of bumping that volume knob. And it's just a little bit harder so it won't bump accidentally, but you as a person can easily turn it if you want to. You can go down to Home Depot and you can just find one of these knobs. Or if you want to, the quick and easy solution, we already sized them out for you. You can go to defensedistributors.com the links in the bio and you can pick one up there as with all these accessories including the radio so on to accessory number two the ptt guard i believe that every radio you have should have a ptt guard you can get some crazy big ones some crazy fancy ones this specifically is the one we sell at defense distributors because it's very very low profile these accessories I'm talking about I think can be applied to any radio regardless of use case and because this is a low profile PTT guard it's not going to take up a ton of space and really doesn't change the setup. The idea behind the PTT guard is really really simple. All this is doing is protecting these buttons on the side of my radio from accidentally being hit. It's adding a little bit of a bumper so if I intentionally want to press that push to talk I can but I'm not going to accidentally bump this, which if you're putting this in a pouch, it's going to bump it, a jacket pocket, whatever. Even if you're just carrying this around, that button's really easy to punch. Sometimes you can even hold it down without you knowing. And so what that PTT guard is going to do is make sure you're not accidentally holding down that button, which in some cases is a really, really bad thing to happen. A lot of the times it's just a nuisance. And so for an inexpensive solution right there, that's something I add to every single radio I own. It doesn't add a lot of size, plus you could still use a belt clip in the back because the screws that are included with it are long enough to do so. And the third accessory that I think every Baofeng radio you own should have is an extended USB-C battery. There's a couple of reasons for this. One, extended batteries obviously provide more battery life, which is great when you're using a Baofeng out in the field and you want to carry extra batteries. That's super cool. Number two, I think that this battery better fits your hand. I hate how small the regular bow things are. They're cool if you're putting them in your pocket, but if I'm actually using this radio, I want one that actually is nice to hold, which this one is when I have an extended battery on. But three, and one of the most important reasons in my mind is the USB-C feature. All of our devices are already using USB-C. Putting a USB-C plug on your bow thing allows you to charge using those same connectors so you're more likely to have one on hand or be able to find one. And recharging this in the field is pretty cool if you don't want to just carry around 15 extra batteries with you. So that's something to consider too if you're looking to really upgrade your radio. And those are the three accessories I think that you should consider putting on every single radio you own. There's very little reason not to have them, especially the first one. I mean, there's no reason not to have that on your radio. So if you want to get any of these accessories or you want to get the radio, you want to get this antenna, you want to get a whole host of other stuff for your radio, you can head to the link in the description, Defense Distributors. Dot com.